I'm 100% confident in my training and the same goes for my Marines. We are more than ready for this deployment and anything to come in the future. We are going to maneuver on our company objective while our other two sister squads suppress their position. Yeah, right. push it on. What? Get on line. Back bus clear. Hey, go! Uh, with the 101 battery integrating with India battery. We did uh, multiple calm rehearsal exercises uh, prior to even going to the field with 101 battery. And then additionally, before we went live with guns, we executed calm rehearsals as well as dry runs. Uh, the end state being that if a forward observer called in a fire mission, whether that forward observer is Australian or US, that that mission could be fired by either Australian artillery or United States artillery. So originally we got our order from Lieutenant Kennedy and then from there we started briefing our Marines. I brought my squad in, briefed them on the scheme of maneuver. That day we went to the airport, loaded up on birds, and then we took off. As soon as we landed, set up 360 security, went to our rally point, and then from the rally point we got into attack column and then patrolled all the way here to the embassy. Coming from the infantry side to what another MOS is essentially supposed to do, reinforce embassies. Um, we have to really maintain composure and then listen to the ROEs. As we got hit with two or three protests and they just progressively got more violent. The most critical point that we had, that was definitely a distraction. They um, were conducting that angry protest. One individual threw a bag over practically in our COC, and then simultaneously we had a breach in the wire and a V-bid went off. So as a riot's going on, individuals throwing trash over, it's just the culminating event essentially.